like you ever felt. Are you listening? Damn. May, so like. What I need to go, what I want, I'm going to go to the town. I'm making my dinner. I'm making baked salmon, the citrus herb salmon. It was already like marinated. I can't wait to see what it tastes like. It smells really good, amazing out the pack. So I have my fries on. My fries is gonna cook for like 18 minutes, 18 to 20 minutes. I have that in. I started that first because when I put the salmon in, I want, you know, to have a good timing when I'm cooking the salmon. But my, I had some dynamite fries from this store called California Fish Grill. And they had like green onions and like a little sauce on top. The fries are so good. So I'm gonna try to make my own dynamite fries. Well, these will be steak fries. And I'll do the baked salmon. I added some leeks on it green leeks i had a, a big stop of leeks i never had leeks before so i was like what do i do with these they look like real huge green onions so i had to google to see what to do with them they was like you know just wash them real good chop them up you could put them in the freezer and it's it tastes like onion to me like a like a green onion to me so i just use it on everything honestly when i'm baking something i just add it add it in to whatever i'm baking so it's a good thing because it's just like onions if you like onions it's like a subtle onion tastes like a green onion so i have got a big bag of those and i just put them to use so now i know what leeks do you got them you have to wash them real good though because they really dirty so i'm trying to think about what sauce can i put on my fries the the sauce was like a orangey with a little spice i don't even know if i have 
anything like that. But I might just add hot sauce. No, I'm gonna add I'm gonna add some mumble sauce because it kind of kind of could go with it. Let me show you what I got. This ain't the real DC style mumble sauce, but it's good. And this has like a sweet, spicy taste. That's why I'm going to use this on the fries. Because it's like a sweet, spicy. I found this at Target. It's Capital City Mumbo Sauce. This DC. We like Mumbo Sauce. I made some bomb Mumbo Sauce chicken wings from scratch before. I probably, if I could find a video, I probably insert, insert it. Because I can make anything long as i have the recipe for it so i'll use this mumbo sauce like just to drizzle over the fries it's it's not like a you don't want to drench it you can but i'm not going to drench it it's just going to be a swirl of it nice little swirl cover the fries and make you know that get that bite of sweet spicy it's going to be good i'm glad i got something so the fries are smelling good with the onions. I added a little bit of oil on it so it could like bake and fry at the same time with the leeks on top, salt and pepper. And yeah, it's just smelling good. It's smelling good. I added a little bit of oil to the bottom of the salmon pan. We'll cook at 400 for 20 to 25 minutes the fries was cooking at 425 so that's why i let the fries get a head start before i really add my salmon in there because i don't want it to cook too fast or you know feel good i ate breakfast lunch and dinner today as you working out you do want to eat breakfast lunch and dinner you don't want to not eat because you're working out so the key to losing weight is to eat healthy throughout the day as well so get your breakfast and lunch and your dinner in so that's what i'm doing and i'm just trying to get back in the routine this is day one i feel good i took my msm this morning that gave me energy so yes i washed four loads of clothes today Got that out the way early. Went to Dunkin' Donuts, got me a coffee. I got me some bagel bites. Mm hmm It smells so good in here. It smells so good. Them leeks smell so good, y'all. I'm gonna show you guys the finished food once it's done. Yes, yes. The fries are done. Let me try them. Let me make sure I get one with a little bit of everything on it. A little bit of everything. Need a little bit of everything. We gonna call them adrenaline fries so good so 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 good see i be macgyvering stuff you guys i barely got any food in here and i it smells like a restaurant in here just from the fries alone these are so good i seasoned them i put a little bit of cayenne pepper i sprinkled paprika on it on accident because i thought it was the cayenne pepper i add salt pepper a little bit of like a sprinkle of onion powder mm. and the capital mumbo sauce just drizzles on it drizzle on it
That should be a chef for real. Mm. Mm. Tastes so good, y'all. I'm trying to wait for the salmon. Try. This is a good combo. Fish and fries. This is perfect sweet, perfect spicy. The onion, the leeks. They just taste so good, you guys. These are going to be my adrenaline fries, steak fries. So good, so good. Seasoned to perfection. They're like perfect. Like you don't need anything else on them. They're just perfect. Salmon done. in my night i'm going to be doing my evening skincare routine and today is tuesday last tuesday i used the product by the ordinary so i'm using it once a week and i used it last tuesday so i'll be using it this tuesday this is the bha peeling solution i'll be using this tonight for my skincare it helps peel, exfoliate, and then you leave it on for 10 minutes. So that's that. First, let me wash my face. Some of this stuff out my way. I'm going to wash my face with a gentle face wash. And today I'll just use this. I'll be using the Everclear Purifying. Get my hands washed. Let me take off my rings. Got it all damp and ready for the wash. So I was mainly in the house all day. I did do the full skincare routine with my sunscreen and everything like that. This is my evening. This on my face. Rub it. I think I'm gonna wash it twice to get all the sunscreen off. I had a pretty productive day, even though I was mostly home. I washed my clothes, I got that out the way. I cooked, I ate three times today. And that's rare, I rarely eat three times a day, but I started, I did a at home workout today. I'm really pushing myself, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Took me a nice shower, changed the filter, which is like a very productive day. Go in with a second wash. It's more suds this time. I ordered me some hair products. The one my stylist mentioned to me to get. I ordered the curling cream. I ordered the hair oil. Twisting cream leave in conditioner. I can't wait to wash my hair again. I've been washing my hair every two weeks. 
and so far i think that's been doing good with the health of my hair and i just got that luxury hair wash by him to start the month of may so like when did i go on the six so and like in the middle of may that's when i wash my hair myself that shampoo by by um bedhead the resurrection red bottle it is a really good shampoo i really like how it feels on my hair so i like to cleanse my face for at least a minute tlc pamper it what i've been doing for my skin has really been working like I seen some texture on my forehead, just texture, and I got to it. Second one, rinse. I have to wait till my face completely dries before I add this. So clean. I'm gonna just wait till it dry, and I'll be back okay my face is completely dry let's get this solution on and i'm gonna put do i say how many drops i put on i'm gonna apply like two to four drops And I'm going to spread it evenly throughout my face. Let my hand feel wet. Do not put it around your eye area underneath your eyes. First time I used it, my skin just felt brighter and smoother. Hopefully it just get better and better with each use. This is my second time using it. I'm gonna just do my face cause I got shea butter on my neck and I didn't wash my neck. So let me set a timer for eight minutes. I feel like a tingle going on right now. Set me a timer for seven minutes. Seven minutes. Counting down. Since my face was, since it was already on my face for at least a minute before I set the timer, I'm going to leave it on for seven minutes. And I'm going to rinse it off with lukewarm water. That's what it's looking like. It's like a thin layer of a red mask. It looks like blood my fingers feel soft that i applied it with my fingers just feel soft i heard you could use it for like your whole body as well but since i already had the dead sea mineral soap that's doing good with exfoliating my skin and everything like that and it's just like a tingle like a little itch feeling like you want to itch it you bet you better not itch it I feel it right here, I feel it on my forehead, like right here. It's not too terrible, it's not like terrible. The only way I think it would be terrible if your skin is still wet. So following the instructions, you guys, dry skin. So, you gotta use these chemicals right because if you don't have like the right stuff to go in you know to help cool it down okay that's on you follow the directions follow the directions do something to keep your mind off the tingles it's tingling like in certain spots more than It's supposed to help with blackheads and everything as well. I'm definitely going to try some of that Dead Sea soap for my face. I don't know. 
I'm gonna look for like a face wash to see how that does. It's supposed to reduce wrinkles and stop wrinkles from popping up. So I can tell with like this peel is good for you know just keeping your skin clear and everything like that. So and timer's up. So it don't really feel like much going on, but a slight tingle. So apply it on dry skin so you won't have to deal with any like unnecessary terrible irritation basically let me rinse it all so i made sure i thoroughly rinsed my face off don't you don't want to leave pills or anything like that on your face so Right now my face just feels smooth, it looks smooth. What I'm looking for, for it with this is just to bring out the best of my skin. So with that rinsed off, you wanna follow up with hydration. So I'm going to use the Double Repair Face Moisturizer by La Roche, it has Nice cinnamide and has ceramides, hyaluronic acid. I've been using this for a while. It's not even halfway yet, but it's getting there. Some of you. From the first time, like I didn't have like no bad effects on my skin. Like I thought I might have like peeling stuff like that going on but i didn't have any of those my skin was just normal i kept it hydrated i guess you know a little pearl let me put some of this lip mask this mom mom melon lip sleepy mask was so good my lips felt extremely dry i don't know where it came from but it felt like sandpaper i put this on and now it's gone this is an asian lip care product but this one really got lineage let me show you what it looks like it's this brand it's so good this stuff is good this is the newest product to my skincare routine. Week two using it. I use it one time a week. So we'll see. I'll keep you updated. So throughout the week, I'll definitely keep my skin super hydrated and moisturized. So it could be at its best potential. I'm back. I just wanted to show you guys these products I just received in the mail today. I had got these products because my hairstylist recommended it to me and I just got the box today I got the I got the leave-in conditioner I got the the herbal hair oil repairing mask curl defining cream twist and define cream so I'm excited you guys to use these products I'm I just retwisted my hair after I came from the salon. So this is the style that I put it in. My hair just feels super soft and everything right now. So it's just like, I don't want to mix products. So what I am going to do is use the oil. This you can use it on dry hair. So I'm just use some of this nourishing oil on my scalp. 
and these products he was telling me oh let me take the thing off he was telling me that he had a client and her hair was just so freaking healthy and he asked her what she was using at home because she was way younger and she was like she barely did any anything to her hair and she was just told him she was using these products so i was like hmm you know i'm gonna try something i am the one that's like to try stuff and i like to know Ooh, this this all feels soft it feels so good and all the products cost it only 45 dollars you guys i'm happy about um the price range and everything he told me that the products used to be a dollar and I was like really but these products has a lot of good um, ingredients mainly like avocado oils and quinoa stuff like that and I just ran out of my avocado oil this oil feels so good this nourishing oil wow it just feels like it's just soft feels so good let me get that crown area at the crown area and that's my little trouble area I like when I'm getting my hair done and the crown they braiding up my crown area because it just be feeling so good oh yeah I'm loving this oil already today from Marshalls. I just got out the shower, got on my all pink, my pink long johns and my pink little tank top that I made by cutting it, simple cut. I want to show you guys what I grabbed today real quick. I got the Real Beauty, this toner. You guys know I had this toner for a while. This would be my third bottle, but I found it for $4.99 at Marshalls. I couldn't believe it. And I usually pay $20 for this uh, real refresh button calming cleansing water with the Sika. I found this beautiful perfume. It's called Clean Classic Soft Laundry. It smells so good. I'm about to put it on now after the shower. Oh, it just smells so clean. It has a, the must. I looked it up online. It was $19.99 at, at Marshalls. But online it's like a hundred dollars and the notes was like jasmine musk i love musk scent so i was like oh i gotta get that and i had got three pair of lashes today well i got these from cbs i got these kiss my lash but better and i got these morphe uh a little a little extra i, I put the little extra morphe lashes on now with the um Lascara bond, and I also have the what is it? What is it? What is it? Some Morphe uh DTLA, I guess it's downtown LA. I don't know what that stands for, but yes, I just wanted to show you guys what I had got today. Yes, my camera is about to die, so I 
feels so good the shower felt so good i used my natural bar soap the grapefruit guava and i uh, used the soft powder uh, baby magic cream lotion this cleans soft laundry smells so good i'm in love i'm in love downtown la can you see them they are pretty too and i had got these everyday lashes by kiss these are nice so easy using this bond from uh the last scare kit they also have the last scare kit in um uh walgreens with just like the bond the tweezers what the tweezers at? come with the tweezers the bond and like a, just a couple lashes but yeah i really don't use these lashes but you they could be useful for like layering if you just want extra lashes but my camera about to die and i'll see you guys oh yeah i'm still on the weight loss journey i, I really need to lose my gut so i'm working on losing my gut like even more i just do not like it at all i have a skill right here and i have the app to the skill to let me know my body fat muscle mass water weight and bmi so right now i'm 131 pounds and i guess i'm trying to get down to 125 so yeah but i like the weight that i have i just want my stomach on and my arms slimmer I just took my hair out and it's still looking good to me like it's only been a week since I washed my hair well since I went to the salon and let my stylist wash it it's only been a week and I put it in twist after the blow dry it just looks so good it's just like laid down and not crazy at the roots and that's what I love about it because yes my roots just feel managed. I like the lay. You see it? I just took the twist out. They still look in them. My hair just feels soft. And it looks really nice. Technically, I've been washing my hair every two weeks now. And it's only been a week since I washed it. But I'm just so geeked. I, I want to use the, my new products that I got so bad. I'm just so pressed to use my new products, honestly. And just, you know, the feeling of washing your hair. I feel like doing that. I don't feel like my scalp is, like, itchy or anything like that. It's just I want to use my products. So, I just took my twist out. I don't know if I'm going to wash my hair today or not. But I do want to do, like, a, um, a treatment like the day before wash day the night before so i don't know what i'm gonna use i know i got like a oil or something i could use but out of the new products i received from dollar curl club curl dollar curl club i used the oil on my scalp you guys that oil feels so good like as soon as i put it on my scalp my hair just felt soft it felt like a silky soft oil that don't make my hair feel weighed down or anything and i just love it i never came across an oil like that before it just feels so good so i use that oil on my scalp and i can already tell that the products is really good my hair just feels so good my scalp feels balanced my hair feels balanced and it just looks good i like when my hair is in a natural state and just laying naturally down you feel me so i just want to let it breathe a little bit it feels moisturized and everything like that so i do want to be careful of my ends and everything like that i love my twists i've been getting a lot of compliments on my hairstyle just a twist and I just love it. I love it, love it, love it. I'm using that Dead Sea soap, right? And I said I wanted to try the face bar soap. 
and I found it today at my local store Ralph's this is where I got the soap from this is how it looks you guys I just want to show you and it's like a white bar it's kind of small 3.5 ounces so I want to try this Dead Sea soap on my face you guys if you could look it up so if y'all just see my skin looking extra extra good the secret is this mineral bar soap because i'm definitely going to probably use it tonight and said by my first secret recipe mineral soap but nothing prepared me for the excitement unleashed y'all hear this they got a whole story on the soap discover why so many of our customers tell us they carry this loving hand pour soap with them at all times they carry this soap with them at all times hide it from others they come to this soap as they have never laid calm to any soap before that's so funny they they carrying in this soap they carrying the soap everywhere with them come on y'all hey i'ma let you know i'm always trying something but I'm trying stuff to benefit myself. I'm not just trying stuff to just be trying it. I'm trying to have good skin. Like I, I never had like completely good skin. And I'm really working on it. I'm really working on it. So yes. I got me these bare. These are the bare. Um, bare but better. True natural. Uh nails this is in the long shape i just love the color the color is so beautiful it's like a nudie peach color so i'm just excited to put these on i haven't put on nails probably like um a week maybe oh my real nails like a light pink color i love this tinted clear pink that i have pink tint on oh they look nasty right now <coughs> So I just took me a lovely shower and I'm about to wash my face with this Dead Sea soap. I just can't, cannot wait to use it you guys. I'm so curious about how it makes my skin feel. So this is the soap I'm going to be using as a white bar. And I'm just going to open it and wash my face. That shower felt so good. What it looks like, it just looks like a bar of soap doesn't have like a smell to it just like a clean smell like a, a glycerin type smell do i have glycerin in here no oh coconut palms we gonna see it says coconut palms so i don't know if that's going to be beneficial to my skin so let me wet my face in my hands Let's see what it do okay, I feel it on my hand it doesn't really set up or anything but I do like see the residue on my hand so let's go with that go in two times to cleanse my face because I got on sunscreen trying to wash the day off oh happy mother's day this is mother's day Sunday mother's day it's a beautiful sunny day in Cali it feels smooth soft and gentle so I'm just trying to, I'm just doing the first wash. Going for the second wash. I don't know if it's going to be good at taking the uh, sunscreen off. Okay, I got a little bit more on my hand from this second. Mm. 
You can see it more with the second wash. And I'm wearing my false scare lashes. They do pretty good. Holding on, I love these lashes, you guys. I love, I, basically I love the bond, the bond that comes with the false scare kit because this, it holds my lashes, it's like, good and i love the tweezers that it comes with to clamp my lashes so i could easily just pop them on i love it and then the fact that i love that i could exchange and switch up my lash style any way i want to so right now i'm just trying to find the perfect lash style for me i like more of the classy um lashes so I love those so they just look like your real lashes but better like my skincare is like it's not all over the place because I'm using a lot of um salicylic acids and uh gentle cleansers and I use it on certain days I use retinol on certain days I use my um the ordinary I just got that BHA on certain days well on Tuesdays so I'm gonna use that Tuesday so far I use that once a week on Tuesdays my face feels clean like it feels like it don't feel stripped but it just feels clean so this bar of soap is a mineral bar of soap my, my face just feels balanced and clean it says you don't have to moisturize but I'm going to moisturize and I'm going to start with this retinol serum. This is the Jose Marin, Moran, Josie Moran, Jose Moran. I use these on when I'm using a gentle cleanser. I don't use them when I'm using like any actives. So I put like four drops on my skin. I'm having a little bit of forehead breakout. I don't know where that's coming from, but I'm using my salicylic acids and everything to get it, get it gone. So yeah, I put this like under my eye, hopefully it help with wrinkles and everything like that. When I put on this retinol, my face just feels smooth when I'm gliding it on my skin. It just feels like a smooth oil. That's that. I had it for a while. Well, I hope it's not expired either. It's like halfway full. I had it for a minute. I'm going with my first moisturizer. This is the um, Dew Point. This is the Gel Cream Texture. This is the type of texture I really like for my oily, acne-prone skin gel cream moisturizer. This is basically starting off my week of skincare. And I just try to listen to my skin. And I'm trying a new soap, so... I pray to God I see some miracle going on with my skin. Be happening back backtrack on my routine. I'm gonna use my toothbrush. Today I'm gonna use this crust 3D white toothpaste. This is the radiant mint. So I just brush my teeth gently with those harder bristles so it won't really uh, remove any enamel on my teeth and everything like that. But I'm going to put some, some TLC on my skin. Like I don't feel like I need to put on anything right now. But I'm going to put on this vitamin E hyaluronic acid. 
body oil this is coconut vanilla so this is nature's good brand i really like it i like the scent of it and this uh, age defining replenishes the skin so i like it it smells like a clean perfume Absorbs into the skin as well. Get those elbows. Good morning, you guys. I'm up. I just did all my skincare and I forgot to show you guys, but it's been really good, you guys. I've been using a dead sea soap for my face i just got that and it's just so good and it's especially good if you have dry skin like the soap is so smooth on my skin i'm just loving it i'm just loving the results this morning i just washed my face i used the dead sea soap it's an actual bar I applied my real toner i just put some in my hand and i just wipe my face with it and then I just let my skin dry down and yesterday I didn't apply a moisturizer because the soap says that you really don't need to moisturize after using it so I just went in with my sunscreen this is the Derma E this is a, a mineral sunscreen scar cream as well so this stuff is really good you guys so my face I've been loving how like normal my face looks when i just do that with no moisturizer it just feels like um like a primed smooth finish not dry looking not oily looking just like balanced so i do like that about this skin routine in the morning i just this is my second day trying it so i'm just not like i'm gonna stick with it forever so i just wanted to try it because the soap has moisturizing properties and the sunscreen itself has moisturizing properties and also the um, real cleansing has the hydrating um, properties as well so I, I'm not going out dry face or anything like that but I applied my falsy lashes I found a really good favorite pack of lashes that I really like they're Remy but they're by the brand Ardell. So I just want to keep these in stock. They're the 775s. This is my outfit for the day. I'm wearing my New York hat. This is all last minute thoughts. I wake up and I was like, what am I going to put on? So first I had put on my gray leggings. Then I said, I'm going to wear my biggie shirt. Then I said, I'm going to wear my Converse. These are the brown ones. And look, I said I'm going to put on these socks with the rose. These socks, they Urban Outfitter socks. What match the rose on my shirt. Then I was like, my hair is really not done. I'm waiting for my uh, shampoo and conditioner coming in the mail. Because wash day is going to be soon. Probably, hopefully today or tomorrow. Because they already taken two out forever for my package. So I was like, let me find a hat. And luckily I had this hat. It's a uh, beige hat with the New York. And he got like a beige jacket on. Look, I don't even be trying. Outfit in t 10 minutes. So I just wanted to show you guys and say hello, you guys. I miss you guys. And everything like that. And I'll talk to you guys later. I'm about to go make some money. Better go grab me some coffee and everything like that. So I'll be back. And my perfume for today, I put on the Coco de Latte Latte Coco. You guys know the Milky White Body Spray uh, perfume that I wear. And I also pair that with the um, Fresh Coconut Water Bath and Body Works Body Spray. So it just smells like a coconut I smell coconut tea mud 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 <laughs> I 
just got back in the house and I stopped at Marshalls before I came home and I was looking at the dress section and I had bought this and I had got the wrong size. I had got an extra small because by looking at it, it looked it way big. So I'm like, okay, I could fit this. Got home, it couldn't even get over my butt. So I'm like, oh no, I gotta go get a small in this because I just love the print. Look how I look in the back. That's how I look in the back. This is a pants set, let me show you. But the thing I don't like about the top, it's like kinda loose like at the sides and stuff so i gotta figure that one out these are what the pants look like they are like kind of a wide leg they're these are like so breathable let me see they're super breathable comfortable and i can wear some flip-flops with them whatever you know super comfortable i love this this is a um zara brand oh i'm about to make me some nettle tea my allergies acting crazy right now but i had got this set and i had got a, two other dresses let me show you those this one is giving body yachty that's what it look like I could wear it with no bra. I might have some little nip covers. And that's about it. But yes, let me try on this last dress that I got today. This is what this one looks like. Ooh. Excuse my light, you guys. It keeps... Man, I thought it was a ghost in here when it first started happening. The light just started flickering all different colors. Like... So I'm thinking it's just a bad light bulb because it's just been a lot of creepy stuff happening in this house. It is so cute to me. It's like going to be like my favorite linen dress. That's what it looked like. That's what it looked like in the back. With the slit. I could just wear my little pretty sandals and everything so I could wear it with Converse and I could wear it with flip flops and be pretty. This is so pretty you guys. It's linen and this is also from Zara. Yeah, I got this from Marshalls. This is an extra small so I had to put it over it was a struggle to get like over my arms because it don't have any stretch but once it's on you see how it fit I had to make me some tea I don't know what's going on today like the allergies just hit me so I made me some nettle tea you guys so I'm going to make sure I start drinking this tea every day because I hate when it sneak up on me. Allergies and stuff. My nose is so itchy. And I'm sneezing. But I'm just so happy with my dress. This is going to be like my favorite dress. And I have to stay small in order to wear it a lot. I'm definitely going to be looking for this in a size small just so I can have it. I love this dress. It's like a perfect dress for me. And while I was out, y'all, I'm a fanatic for two brushes. I just got that gold bass toothbrush. I'm a fanatic for um toothpaste. I had just got me some toothpaste because I'm, I've been using like the um fluoride free toothpaste. I have a couple of toothpastes over here that I go in between and switch up to, but I was like, I need a little bit more white whitening, so I had picked up this crest can you see it this crest sensitive whitening and when i tell y'all my teeth feel so good it looks like super natural white you feel me natural white well just a natural whitening color and i love the taste of it it's a gel and everything like that 
why i found me a pink and white vast toothbrush you guys it's so beautiful pink and white this is a uh, natural bristles made in italy i'm about to open it because y'all let me open it okay i want to touch it this is what it's looking like it's beautiful it feels beautiful this different shape bristles this is a medium medium um texture good it has a little serial number on the back so it's an official bass toothbrush i'm just loving it it's like a pink and white stripe my hair it's i twisted it up i really wanted to wash my hair real 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 bad but the products that i ordered did not come in i ordered a shampoo conditioner and i ordered a co-wash i didn't want to use the bed head shampoo this time i wanted to use the whole product line of um the curl dollar curl club that i got they they um messing up on my shipment for real i paid for a two-day priority and they it's been five days so i've been emailing them like where's my stuff at here i put twist all over my hair and it's like this because i have it stretched i put barbie pins like all over just to have it stretched because once I hit it with that water, baby, it was given like right here. It's back moisturized and everything. That's a good thing because you don't want to leave your hair dry. You feel me? And I didn't want to go any more days dry because if I would have had my products, I would have washed my hair. But yes, it's given. How long I had my hair? It's been about two weeks. So I could go like another week, honestly, without washing my hair. So till the meantime and the in between time it will be moisturized and everything like that good morning you guys i'm just waking up it's about 6 a.m i don't know i'll be waking up at like 6 a.m sometimes to go get me some dunkin donuts and go make me some money go to work make me some money it's supposed to be cloudy rainy today when i just looked at the weather yesterday and it said sunny so i'm telling you this california weather has been bipolar so if it's going to be raining i'm going to wear some rain type clothes so pulled out this little sweatshirt from the back of my closet i just re um put on my lashes I use, I had got some different glue for my lashes because I didn't want to just use the bond because I, my real lashes come first. So if those coming out, I got to change the formula to make the lashes stay. So I picked up this, um, still got the box, this house of lashes eyelash glue this is from target and it has the vitamin e in it that's why i picked it up and i will apply it like on two sides of the lashes and i will apply the bone like in the middle the bone really bonds it but like i said my real lashes come first so yeah i'm trying to keep those on and alive so i'm about to wash my face roll up my sleeves for real i should have washed my face before i put on this shirt but for me first thing you're going to do is drink some water in the morning oh i forgot i gotta take my twist out and all these barbie pants let's get let's brush my teeth i've been loving this sensitive uh whitening toothpaste by Colgate even though I'm not a big fan of uh fluoride toothpastes but it's just gonna be like a temporary thing because I go in between so many toothpastes so
Yesterday I was eating chocolate. I had um, these honey graham crackers covered in chocolate that I found in uh, Marshalls yesterday. And they taste so good. Like I love some chocolate, but I don't eat it every day because I don't want cavities, you feel me? But I had like three or maybe four pieces. And they was like big squares. Let me wash my face. This is just like to wet my hands and wet my face like that. I'll take the soup, wet it, get a nice coating on my hands. That's a good enough amount. That's a good enough amount. Let me just wash my face. Gentle is so like soft and silky. It's so soft and silky. It feels hydrating. Like that. Mm -hmm. But I'm loving this um this bar of soap. But I'm trying to get my skin the best it could be and like this is the best it has ever been being an adult like I'm freaking happy I'm proud of myself for not giving up and for really like paying attention and getting my skin and trying new things like once I heard about, you know, Dead Sea, once I tried that soap bar for my body, I just been seeing, like, my thighs looking a bit better. And I was just like, what's going on? The soap felt so soft and comforting and just hydrating and just felt right. See, right now, it don't look like I'm... I um, have anything on my face, but I do. I just want to be gentle. It feels so good. Let me rinse. My skin just feels like a smooth, matte, clear, like this is so smooth. Real refresh button. And my hands. Slide it all over my face like that. This is like an extra cleansing step along with hydrating the real refresh button I love this I'm so glad I got this for $4.99 from uh, Marshalls I'm usually paying $20 a bottle I was just surprised that I saw it there but yes this is, has the common sickle cleansing water you guys have removed all traces of makeup impurities without stri stripping your skin is formulated with sicca or centinella centella extract and h3o hyaluronic acid leaving skin looking supple and radiant 
I use that day and night. It just feels so good on my skin. I'm going to go in with a light moisturizer today. Burst. You guys know the burst. Dew point moisturizing gel cream. I love my gel creams. Put my stuff at the floor. What are you doing on the floor? Let me just a nice dime size of that. And this is how I've been spreading my product on lately. Instead of just with one hand, I'll take two. And do like a motion like this. that type of motion as you see I just do it with one hand but I'm trying out this motion like take on both of my tips of my fingers each hand Last but not least, my Derma E Mineral Sunscreen. I love this. It makes my face feel like it has um, like a breathable primer on it. So I just use, I don't use a lot on it. So like they say put a whole finger line of sunscreen, but I don't. I don't. I just put it in each section of my face if I do that I do that and this goes in the skin pretty good it feels really good And doing this motion helps your sunscreen really get into that skin quick and fast so you won't have all white calves. And a little something. That's it. Let me take out this hair. And my hair. It should be dry. Mm -hmm. Take out all the body pans I put in here. I don't know. I might wear a hat today anyway. I don't know. I don't know how many body pans I put in here. It's stretched. That's what they looking like. This side. Uh,
I'm using my robe because I don't have really nothing that's uh, gentle to like put over my hair to dry it. And this robe is like the perfect material. Using my robe real quick to just get it to a damp point before I put my leave-in conditioner and everything like that. So let's go do that. Look at this curl, y'all. Wow, that thing curled. Y'all see it? Oh my god, it looks so cute. So what I use, you guys. My head feels amazing, like I'm not even mad, I'm not disappointed because I really wanted to start using, uh, where I got them white little spoils on my head from that towel, but I wanted to use the whole line of this new product I got, but look, my hair feels amazing, like it feels lightweight, it feels um, moisturized, balanced strengthen and let me show you what i use i tried to show you guys me wash my hair in the shower but the camera kept steaming up i ain't have time for that so the best shampoo i picked out was this um camille rose this is the sweet ginger cleansing rinse this has castor oil and aniseed oil But this one was gentle. I washed my hair twice. It has a good lather. It was just soft on my scalp. I put it on my scalp. So once I rinse that out and everything, I went to my uh, 22nd Century Naturals. This is a Hairomatic. This is like a conditioner slash um, clay wash, but not really a wash. It's like a conditioning clay. So I just put this on the ends on down from the roots on down i didn't put it on my scalp because it is it has conditioner in here so i avoided my scalp with any type of conditioner and i put like two dollops nice little size dollops on each side i washed my hair in two sections then over top of that i applied the design extensions this is the almond avocado moisturizing detangling conditioner i added like a nice little um pinky length size of conditioner over top of that and i was able to detangle really smoothly with those uh two concoctions on each strand i took my bass dimming brush and i started with this side i would detangle going down all throughout my hair then i turn it and and go this way and this detangled it in seconds it was so easy and everything like that so i just left that on for three minutes the conditioner then i rinsed the conditioner out on both sides and i, I shampooed my hair one section at a time then after i rinsed out that conditioner and everything like that i applied this dollars maintain by dollars curl club this is the repairing hair mask that has green tea and shea and I applied this on my hair and I just rinsed it out with you. I left it in for about 20 minutes after I got out the shower and put on my clothes and everything like that with my shower cap on. I meant, yeah, a deep conditioning cap. I put that on once I was in that shower after I applied this. And this was my first time using this mask. It smells like amazing fruit, like a bomb fruit island can you see this can you see it that's what she looking like you guys and it uh it felt amazing on my hair once i applied the deep conditioner i'm about to go in while my hair is still damp and apply my leave-in conditioner because i don't want to put it on dry hair so i'm gonna just do both sections i'm gonna put my leave-in now for both sections and I'm gonna start from the bottom. My hair, after I rinsed out the deep conditioner, you guys, my hair just feels so good. So good. And I gotta give it to that repairing mask. Did something, some wonders to my hair. 
it feels so good it feels so light it feels a balance between strength and moisture it just feels so balanced you guys sorry if i look a hot mess honestly like i've been down for like three days so it was just like right now i still feel sluggish and everything like that um i had some type of body flu reaction from starting to take these probiotics i started taking probiotics um when was it like friday maybe thursday i started taking these 30 billion fortified women's probiotics it was a 30 billion um microorganism right i was fine up until because i started taking them probably like on wednesday and I was fine up until like Friday, Saturday, I started feeling like my allergies was acting up real bad. And it was just like, I kept sneezing, nose running everywhere. I'm just like, man, what is going on? Then Saturday, that's when it was like, I, I got body aches and everything like that. And I'm just like, what is going on? So I really couldn't go to work. And so I was just really taking care of myself. Um, yesterday I woke up feeling like 70% better because I didn't have the body aches and uh, today it's just like my throat I'm coughing up like cold phlegm and stuff like that so it's just it's just so weird like I didn't really rest either while I was feeling bad I was just doing research like can probiotics cause like flu flu type symptoms and yes it can i'm just like wow i did not know so i was taking dead sea salt baths i took like two of those drunk some nettle tea first i was drinking nettle tea because i thought it was my allergies that's what it was started with like my nose was itchy runny eyes was itchy runny but I'm better now. I'm getting, I'm like 80% better now, you guys. So I just had to wash my hair to feel renewed. The, the leave-in conditioner, you guys, feels so good on my hair. Wow. I'm loving it. it feels so good. Now I'm going to apply this twist. Ooh, this man's this twist and define cream by this brand this is what i'm using the twist and define cream you guys oh, moisturize the frizz as manageability manageability supposed to make your hair manageable so let me just go in with a nice little coat on my hands let just go from there this smells like, you know, Shea. What's in this one? This is the Shea and Avocado scent. It's not like a too powerful scent. Like, from the repairing mesh, your hair still smells good from that. And the leave-in conditioner. And this is just like... Your hair gonna smell so good using these products, honestly. My hair just feels good right now. So, I'ma just put a little bit in like sections, make sure I get my crown area. Cause that's the part that wanna act up. But I wanted to use the whole set, but I'm not mad. Like, God, you was with me on this wash day. My hair feels so good. It looks so good. And I don't know if you guys could tell, like, it's shorter. But all I'm worried about health. Hair health. So I'm, I'm applying this. And I'm just making sure it's thoroughly even in my crown area. For the moisture and last but not least look at that shine my hair looking so good 
I still sound stuffy and everything congested because I am, you guys. Last but not least, the nourishing um, herbal oil. This is so soft and silky on my hair, my scalp. This is a wonderful oil. I like how it smells. I like how it feels. It feels like luxury on the hair. I love this stuff. So I'm going to just put the oil like on the ends. So I'm going to just take a little bit. Make my light acting crazy. And I'm going to just like that. from the ends and just apply on the ends the oil it's on my hands but I'm only putting it on the ends trying trying to pay attention to learn I learned a little stuff from hair doctors and chemists and everything like that so I'm, I like to try stuff sure all that oil is off my hands and on the ends of these hers I'm definitely going to twist up my hair you guys because my hair is so prone to single strand knots when it's not in a stretch state and I do not like single strand knots I see the more that I keep it in twist and keeping it moisturized in the twist the less single strand knots I have to deal with my hair feels so good, you guys. I'm probably not going to um, twist it right away. I'm going to let it breathe. Oh, I might twist it right away. Yeah, I'm going to just twist it up, you guys. But this is how my hair looks. The left side is longer than right i still have this weird shape going on but oh well as long as it's healthy i do not care right now it will catch up and it'll be all right i'm about to twist my hair up you guys so i'm not going to show you that because i don't i don't do it neatly or anything so i just wanted to show you guys the products i was using for my wash day show you guys it's my wash day and yes my hair is doing good feeling good doing good please